When new, glass is bright and sparkling, easy to clean and keep clean. However, exposure to weather, contaminants and harsh abrasive cleaning causes the glass surface to corrode. This leads to staining, discoloration and difficult maintenance of the glass surface. ClearShield is a high quality and durable protection for glass. Its simple and safe application process converts the unprotected high maintenance surface of glass into a non-stick, low maintenance surface so that the glass is always easier to clean, stays cleaner for longer, resists staining and discoloration. ClearShield has a track record of over 20 years successful use worldwide in a wide range of applications including architectural buildings, reducing costs during and after installation and keeping the building looking as good as new. Marine vessels, increasing visibility, safety and the sparkling appearance of all internal and external glazed areas. Shower enclosures, preventing limescale buildup and difficult cleaning. Windows and conservatories, kept looking pristine and decorative glass, protected from contamination and made easier to clean. Sandblaster glass looks good, but often it is situated where it is especially prone to surface contamination from fingerprints, pollution and water damage. Cleaning the glass might not remove all the contamination and can risk damaging the glass further. ClearShield Sandblast Protect has been formulated to bring all the benefits of ClearShield to Sandblaster glass, always providing a uniform protection across its surface. Your Sandblaster glass will become easy to maintain and will stay looking good for longer. Clear shield can be applied to sandblaster glass using automatic machines or manual spray depending on the volume of production. Only use Ritec approved machinery for the application of clear shield. This video will demonstrate the manual application of clear shield to sandblaster glass in three easy stages. For the application procedure, you will need a canister of Clear Shield Sandblast Protect, Clean All, safety glasses, a mask and protective gloves, a soft bristle brush or a dry and clean airline, a bucket, tea bars, and a microfiber cloth or a squeegee, fresh running water or a pump spray. The use of demineralized water is recommended in hard water areas. Spray equipment such as an M7 or M9 UK. In this video we will be using an M9 UK spray. You will find a short clip about the operation and maintenance of the M9 UK at the end. Wear safety glasses, protective gloves and a mask when handling clear shield. Ensure your workspace is well ventilated and well lit. Do not smoke, eat or drink while using the products. Do not use suction pads on the surface of sandblaster glass before or after application. We recommend that you take time to study the ClearShield application manual. Stage 1 is the surface preparation of the glass. This video provides guidelines for the application of ClearShield in the factory onto newly sandblaster glass. Newly sandblaster glass does not require a complicated surface preparation as contamination is removed during the sandblasting process. However, the surface of the glass must remain clean and dry in order to achieve optimum performance of the clear shield protection. We therefore recommend that clear shield is applied as soon as possible after sandblasting to avoid the buildup of humidity and contamination on the glass surface. Otherwise, the glass will need to be washed using pre-cleaner as demonstrated later in the video. 
dust the glass surface using a soft bristle brush or a clean and dry airline to take away all residues left by the sandblasting process. The glass must remain clean and dry during handling. Avoid recontamination of the glass surface prior to the application of clear shield. Wear protective gloves to avoid transfer of natural oils from hands onto the porous surface. Operating theatre conditions are not necessary, but reasonable awareness and sensible precautions are required. The next step is to apply Clear Shield Sandblast Protect onto the surface of the glass, which we will demonstrate here using M9 UK spray equipment. Leave the inlet valve off and open the outlet valve and the mini ball valve. The spray gun should be held 15 to 20 centimetres, 6 to 8 inches away from the glass. Move the spray across the glass in overlapping stripes, covering all areas evenly. Repeat the spraying with overlapping vertical stripes to ensure that no area is missed. Here we see the spraying action again. The coverage of Clear Shield Sandblast Protect is in the range of 15 to 18 square metres per litre, depending on the coarseness of sandblasting and density of application. After spraying, shut off the mini ball and outlet valves and leave the clear shield to cure. In a well ventilated area with average temperature and humidity, a curing time of minimum 30 minutes is required. Otherwise, leave the clear shield to cure for at least 60 minutes. The next stage is the removal of the excess polymer from the surface of the glass. After application of Clear Shield Sandblast Protect, some excess polymer will appear on the glass surface as a greasy film. This excess polymer may be left on the glass for longer than the required curing time, but it should be removed before the glass is packed and shipped. We recommend bleached pure greaseproof paper, 36 grams per square meter, for the interleaving or packing of the glass. Always take care to remove excess polymer from any area where suction pads will be used to handle the glass. However, we do not recommend the use of suction pads on sandblaster glass, even after the removal of excess polymer. To remove excess polymer, wash the surface of the glass using Cleanall. Pour two capfuls of Cleanall into five litres of warm water and wash the glass thoroughly using a tea bar. Rinse the surface of the glass with clean water. If a polymer haze is still present, this could mean insufficient cleaning or that the water is not warm enough. In that case, repeat the process with warmer water and clean all. Finally, dry the glass with a squeegee or a microfiber cloth. The application is now complete. Remember, do not use suction pads on the surface of sandblaster glass, even after the removal of excess polymer. As a quality control test to ensure that Clear Shield Sandblast Protect is bonded with the surface of the glass, use a trigger spray bottle containing fresh water. The water droplets should be round. Apply more sprays of water to the glass. The water droplets should readily run down the surface. These observations mean that the application of Clear Shield has been successful. Failing to make these observations could be due to improper preparation of the glass surface or to the premature removal of the excess polymer before curing is complete. The reapplication of Clear Shield Sandblast Protect 
is in this case necessary. Avoid recontamination of the surface of the glass prior to the reapplication of clear shield and allow it to dry thoroughly, either under natural conditions or using filtered compressed air or a heater blower such as a fan heater. You are then ready to return to stage two. You can clearly see the difference between treated and untreated glass. Clear shield glass has a satin finish resembling acid etch glass. Its surface has improved resistance to fingerprints and other contamination, and water runs off it in round droplets. As a result, clear shield glass is always easier to clean, stays cleaner for longer, and resists staining and discoloration. Abrasive cleaning methods and compounds should not be used on clear shield protected sandblaster glass. Always give a copy of maintenance guidelines available in the ClearShield application manual to the person who will be in charge of glass care. ClearShield is part of a unique and fully integrated system for the renovation, protection and maintenance of glass. A full range of specialist products and equipment is available for removing almost any staining and discoloration suffered by glass, restoring it to an as-new condition ready for the low-M treatment. The ClearShield system can be applied in the factory or to glass already installed on site. Specialist maintenance solutions are also available. These are highly effective, environmentally responsible and compatible for use on clear shield protector glass. Private branding is also available for these products. We can also supply full technical support, promotional material and demonstration aids. Please contact your local supplier for further information. This section is only relevant if the application of clear shield is not made straight after the sandblasting process. Bear in mind that this video is for the factory application of clear shield only. If the glass is heavily contaminated, we recommend that you re sandblast the glass before the application of clear shield. For on site work, please refer to the relevant manual. For this special pre cleaning procedure, you will need pre cleaner, safety glasses, and protective gloves a T-bar and a bucket, fresh running water or a pump spray. The use of demineralized water is recommended in hard water areas. Some of the products are classified as irritants. Wear protective gloves and we recommend the use of safety glasses when handling pre-cleaner. Add the pre-cleaner to a bucket of clean water and wash the glass using a T-bar. For normal usage, Add one part of pre-cleaner to five parts of water. For heavy duty cleaning, add one part of pre-cleaner to one part of water. Rinse the glass thoroughly using running water or a pump up spray as we are using here. Allow the glass to dry thoroughly either under natural conditions or using filtered compressed air or a heated blower such as a fan heater. Avoid recontaminating the surface of the glass prior to clear shield application. The M9 UK is a reliable and easy to use manual spray suitable for the application of clear shield. The following steps will ensure that your M9 will always perform as expected. Before filling with clear shield, relieve the pressure using the release valve and ensure that both valves are in the off position. Remove the lid and place it on a clean surface. Carefully pour the contents of a canister of Clear Shield Sandblast Protect into the reservoir and replace the lid, ensuring that it is correctly seated. Before filling the pressure pot with air, check the status of the desiccant dryer. The crystals it contains change from blue to pink with use, 
When they are pink, they are saturated and need to be replaced. Twist and release the protective cover. Remove the plastic container and fill with clean and dry crystals. Replace the container and cover. Connect the desiccant dryer's pressure nozzle to the M9 and fill with compressed air running through the desiccant dryer until the pressure is at 4 bars. Remove the desiccant dryer and open the outlet and mini ball valves. The M9 is now ready for use. If the M9 is not to be used for one full day or more, we recommend that the clear shield is removed from the outlet system after use. This is done as follows. Turn the mini ball valve on the spray gun off and shut the air inlet valve on the M9. Release the pressure using the ring pull on the safety release valve. Allow the clear shield within the blue hose to drain back into the pressure pot by holding the gun above the pressure pot. It is also recommended that the nozzle, filter and valve seat are immersed in a solution of clean oil and water. When reassembling, it is important that these parts are dried thoroughly using a lint-free cloth or using a compressed airline. This basic procedure will ensure trouble-free clear shield spraying at the start of the next working day.